Did Malf get the uh, the real check mark today? By the way, like did he did he get the new gray check mark? That's like the ang the old check mark. Which one is the real one? Uh, the one that's that says official on it is the real one to me. In terms of what verification is. That being said, I don't really care like if anybody. Oh, they already rolled it. They already removed the new one. Well, it just came out today. It's already gone. I was on the internet for like five seconds this morning. It's, it's, things are moving so fast these days. What's the point of the old one? What do you mean? Like the... It's just like... I actually like... I just can't stomach any more... This is the relic. We probably just won the game. I can't stomach any more takes about Twitter. Just because like it's already... Like so many people have spent so long talking about it. If, if I have friends who want to spend eight bucks a month on the blue check mark, what do I care? You know, hug your kids, pet your animals, you know, d d treat people nicely. Who gives a shit? It's not a, that big of a deal. I do think that they should add, maybe like they don't have to have like a, don't have to confuse things by having like a, a, a one check mark that's like they paid for the money and the, or they paid money for it. And then like one check mark that's like, um, they're actually like a government official or whatever, but I don't I mean, it's just, I don't know. I, I don't care too much. I do think they're horrible decisions, but also I'm like, man, it would be like the best thing that ever happened if like the website died. It would be like a net good for mankind <laughs> if the website went out of business. So <laughs> I don't want to say anything that could like compromise that reality from coming to pass. Something else would take its place. Yeah, but I could like, you know, not be there. You gotta remember, like, people my age, when we joined social media, most of the time it was like, wow, that Facebook thing did so well, we might as well join Twitter. Now, like, you know, with the benefit of 10 years of, 15 years, I guess, of hindsight, we're like, I'm never doing that shit again, are you crazy? I can't, it's blowing my mind when I'm seeing people my own age that are like, come follow me on Mastodon. I'm like, you're, you're really, you, you went through the last decade on Twitter and you said, oh yeah, I'll re-up. I'll sign another, I'm, I'm going in for another tour of duty. Some people rely on social media for part of their income. Yeah, but like, not that many. I mean, like, I'm kind of one of them. Sometimes in a sponsored deal, you know, it's like baked into the contract that they like want to tweet. And I'm like, I see the analytics on this shit. Listen, I'm, I'm, I'm just like you guys. When I see a sponsored, a sponsored stream, sure. If it, if it looks cool, I'll watch it. But like a sponsored tweet, I'm like, I'm not clicking on this shit. Are you crazy? Tweeting to like 187,000 people and like, you look at the tweet result and you're like, five people clicked on this tweet. How about all those social media managers for corpse? It, like, you, I'm just, this is with sincerity and it's with, um, it's with goodness in my heart. You just got, sometimes, there's always gonna be a negative to like anything positive. <laughs> I'm not saying it's for the greater good necessarily because Hot Fuzz has ruined that logic forever of course but uh, honestly, it's like you know you're like well it would be good if there was less war. Ah but then what about the soldiers you know like you know it's it just because I'm not advocating for people to lose their jobs for no reason. I'm just saying, you know, when we pull the history books from, like, you know, the sands of the uh, desert that used to be North America, there will probably be, like, a chapter. In, like, the 2008 history books, it'll be like, look at this new innovation, social media. Let's see where the 21st century takes us. And then one written in 2099 is going to be like, if you are reading this, please use your time, put the crystals in the time machine, go back to 2004 and unplug the Wi-Fi in Mark Zuckerberg's dorm. It's the only chance. It's a... We, wait, hold on. It's the perfect time for... There's no other way. We have to fix the timeline. Sorry, I realize he's going a lot faster when he does that. Anyway. It's true. We would lose some great accounts. Well, like, I mean, no. We, we wouldn't lose them because they would maybe go somewhere else. But, like, you know, Frasier looking at video games. Sure, like, go to Tumblr. But I don't need to see Frasier looking at video games every day. It's a little hit of, like, you know... Hopium to make Twitter better for sure. Like my Twitter experience got a lot better once I realized that there was like no obligation to get mad every day and instead I should just follow like, you know, the bread and circuses that I find the most uh, entertaining. But even still, I think it would be like a net good for not only my life, but also like life in general if it was 
removed from the, the internet, but you can disagree with that. It's fine. It's just one man's opinion. Twitter's good for sports news. Okay, like, won't somebody think of the sports news, though? I think I'd be... <laughs> just doesn't... Just, it... You know, like, people may do back in the day without everybody being like, you know, last year I was a high school senior, this year I'm an insider to the Arizona Coyotes locker room, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. I think there should be, like, a, a be real... If you're not familiar, by the way, and you might not be, depending on you, like, if you're as old as me, I don't even know how I know about Be Real. Must have talked about it on a podcast or something. It's like a social network where, like, once a day, they send a notification to your phone, and they're like, take a picture of where you are right now. So it's like to combat, you know, that Instagram reality where everything's, like, highly posed and... Uh, like, look, I've rented, like, a private jet, and look at me, I'm on my private jet that took, like, 12 days to set up, like, one photo, okay? We know what it is, we're not old? Okay, fair enough. Listen, they need a... I'm not interested in that at all, for the record. But what if they made a B-reel that was, like, you're forced to take a photo of whatever food you're eating? I would join that social network. If it was just, like, a... a it had to be a photo of, like, whatever you were... B-meal, that's so good! If it had, if it was just a photo of whatever you had for lunch, like, that day. And, like, some days you would be like, oh, wow, you're at, like, a nice restaurant. And then some days you would be like, holy cow, this is like, you're eating, like, you know, a cheese string and some saltines over the sink. I had no idea. That'd be a cool app, man. Me eating my 40th rotisserie chicken in 40 days and seeing God. I mean, my, they might as well call the app, like, Bee Sandwich for me because... I do be eating the sandwiches like like every damn day. Like like 2x daily. Did you already do a bit about the check marks? Like kind of. I just like I'm not that pressed about like Twitter business decisions. It's more just like I don't understand why. I guess there's people out there that are like really offended by the existence of the check mark. And the fact that it's only for people who like are who they say they are. Like they think that the checkpoint, or the check mark is like a source of power for people they disagree with. But like it's just, why, couldn't you just use like a different shape? It just doesn't make sense. Can't you just use a different shape? Twitter should add affiliates. Yeah, dude, that's what I'm saying. I also don't understand why they're talking about like, um, hey, we're gonna introduce like monetization for creators on Twitter. I'm like, bro, you just you gave up the whole game. I just realized. You're, you're, I'm making the content that you're putting ads in front of. If I'm not making the content, you're not able to run any ads. Why are you serving me ads? I should be getting no ads. You should be paying me. I was happy to post for free until I remembered that, you know, like this website is apparently it has to make money. Well, now I'm, now it's work.